guys, so I'm in LA right now and I'm just waiting for Danny and Abby to get here. We're up here this weekend for IMATS and I'm not actually going to IMATS. I didn't buy a ticket, but I am going to the Knicks party tonight and just meeting up with some of the girls for lunch and just seeing a lot of my friends that I haven't seen in a long time. So I thought this would be kind of a fun weekend and I wanted to show you what a dork I am. So I brought my own food. Guys, I'm serious about this. I'm not even joking about this new way of eating. So it's filled with like fruit. I have pineapple. Um, I don't know what else. This is like the 31 bag. I have oranges and apples. I even brought a knife so I can cut my oranges. And then um, luckily there's a refrigerator and I'll show you what's in my fridge. Strawberries and watermelon and then I have some water bottles because I am not going off track mm -mm. that is what I brought to eat and then if we go out to a restaurant or something I'll probably just get like a salad or something anyway just wanted to check in and say hi and I will I'm running out of breath I will make sure to vlog throughout the weekend um, if there's good stuff to show you Hey guys, so I'm at the Knicks party and I'm with Abby and Danny and Melissa and um, there's a lot, it's, there's a lot, you probably can't even hear me but I just wanted to say hi and I'll show you, I'll turn the camera around and show you guys what's going on. I'm drinking water. I'm still not clear. I love that. Ooh, Tintin. Okay, so I just have to show you some of the ones that I'm like most excited about trying. So these CC creams, they have a light and a dark um, for brightening, evening discoloration, and neutralizing redness. Then Abby and Danny were very excited about the banana powder. What did you say that was really good for? It's good for brightening. So like under, like the, under eyes. the eyes. Yeah, under to the eyes. Set like, concealer. Yeah, like in the T-zone where you would put like a brightening concealer or brightening face product. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to leave that out. I'm going to try that tomorrow. We got a lot of blushes, but this color was like so pretty. And then these <laughs> eyeshadows, like you just barely touch them and you get a ton of color. So pretty. So I pulled those out, of course, because they're gold and I love them. These lipsticks. This one is high voltage. These are the Butter Gloss Intense. And then these ones are Simply Pinks. Of course, those are the ones I like the most. These different primers. So they have the HD Photogenic one, the Angel Veil, Pore Filler, and Shine Killer, which I haven't tried any of these things, so I'm excited. I'm excited about everything, but I think these are the ones I'm most excited to try. It's super early. We're going to Soul Cycle. Abby's dragging us in. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess I should I should vlog. Have fun. Okay, this is my first time. I'll tell you guys what I think. Hey guys, I just got home from IMATS and I just wanted to show you my outfit because I'm kind of excited about it because it's new. This is the outfit that I got from TJ Maxx. If I didn't put the haul up yet, it's coming up soon. Um I'm so excited about it. So this, we'll start up here. This is the necklace here. Let me see if I can get a little bit closer. This is like a chunky, I'm so backwards filming it in the mirror. 
necklace from C Jewelry on Etsy. I love her jewelry and this is probably one of my most favorite pieces. This BB bracelet from Twisted Silver um, and then just a bunch of bangles. I think there's one from Twisted Silver and then just random random ones here. And then this is like a dark navy blue. It's like pleated. I don't know what the material is exactly but I just I'm in love with, the, with this shirt. I want the shirt in every color and I want to wear it every single day of my life. And then the pants. I'm like so excited about these pants. They're like total bell bottoms. They feel like they're pajamas but they're not. They're actual pants you're supposed to wear in public. And they're like soft. I wish you guys could feel how soft they are. And then my shoes are these wedges here. I'll see if I can put it up here. Um, which I think I got at like TJ Maxx or Ross a while ago. And then my socks. These are from Primark in London. Yeah, that's what I wore today to IMAX. This is the best part of coming home. Oh, I missed you. You miss me? Mm -hmm. Is it just not the same without your mom? Mm -mm. What's happening here, Jimmy? <laughs> We're gonna go night hiking. <laughs> you are. I'm gonna bring a pocket. All ready to go. You got a po What's the pocket knife for? In case I have to fight coyotes. <laughs> I want to bring a pocket knife to kill coyotes too. <laughs> <laughs> We're warrior hunters, Summer. Can I share your pocket knife? Tell you what, if, if anything happens... Why don't really you just use your mad jujitsu skills? I, I will. Why if I take my loose It's really dark in here. But what, I'll, what I'm going to do is, if I'm attacked by a wild coyote, I'll use jujitsu to totally subdue it and, and put it I'll to sleep. I'll punch mm -hmm. its head off. It's and, then, <laughs> and then my deadly jujitsu <laughs> choke will probably like break its neck and kill it. It'll, and bite, then, it'll bite as soon as you go And then I'll, I'll take my knife and I'll skin it and clean it, and I'll come home with the coyote meat, and I'll cook it up for the family. Mm. <laughs> you miss me? Yes. No. Are we going to snuggle tonight? Yes. I said don't. I do it. We've got to go. Are you ready? Yes, there you go. Okay. Okay, so Taylor oh, made this while I was gone. It was working oh, yeah. on it the day I left. Copied it off of a book, so this is the top part. That is so cool. And I keep some stuff in here. Mm -hmm. And then I keep my most valuable Legos, or... Most rare Legos. Mm -hmm. These are like a dollar and a half each piece. Um, Do you love these, it, Chloe? Each, each of these is like a dollar yeah. and a half. So this is like that's what you keep in that like little, five, little. This Mom. is like four dollars. Yeah. Mom. And then Mom. I can just that's so cool. Hold on. Wait. I, look. Yeah. Uh, but but on the book, but in the book it was brown and white. Oh yeah, right. I, I so think you changed it a little bit. Brown and um yellow. So then you just stick it right back here. Mm hmm. Looks like there's nothing there. That is so cool. How long did it take? Can you? I play with Felix Kanama? Mm, 27 hours, maybe. <laughs> the part that I, that um, was the hardest for me is this part because it's so complicated. I mean, how would you make it go up? So it's just super hard. Are you gonna be so an engineer when you grow up? I connected it. I just took these. I think You're he wants to be a physicist. Oh, yeah, I do. A, a physicist. Oh, a physicist? Uh, what are you going to be when you I grow up, Chloe? I use like, all my Legos. Same. Like, I thought you were going to be a veterinarian. She's going to be a physicist and help me. So and look, I'm, 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 I use all of those. And be a vegetarian, too. A vegetarian or a veterinarian? A, veter a vegetarian. <laughs> so a vegetarian is someone who doesn't eat meat. And a, veter a veterinarian takes care of animals. What, what, what yeah, about, I, I what, what about the veterinarian? I don't know what that is. So true. you're going to be a physicist and she's going to be a physicist. Study anti-gravity. And she's going to help you? Uh-huh. She's going to be the drawing person. The drawing person? Yeah. The person who draws out the math and stuff for the physics. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Are you ready for that job? Uh, yeah. Oh, mom. And this is my new niece. Not like a baby Sayla. They didn't used to give it to Do you love her? Yeah. My sister just had her baby. She's so cute. Oh, I just want to eat her up. She's so cute. She looks like you did when you were a baby. Did I wear the pink thing? You wore pink things, but she looks so different than Roman. I love her so much. What do you think, Chloe? She's cute. Do you love her? Yes. Look at her eyes are open. She wanted to meet you. 
She's like, where's my cousin? Nancy, he's just gonna give you kisses. <gasps> Hi, Missy. Look at you. Do you love her so much? Yes. Look at this sunset. We're just leaving my sister's house. And it's just so beautiful. Look at that nice crack in our windshield, too. All right, we're driving home from my sister's and we're all starving. So Jimmy stopped at Chipotle. And what's in here? He got me a burrito. Okay, it's brown brown rice, black beans, uh, the grilled veggies, which is like bell peppers and onions, and um, guacamole. That's it? They That's don't, it. There's no dairy, no meat. Nothing like that, right? Nope, it's... Uh, plant-based whole foods, raw <laughs> vegan for you. All right, we just got home and I am rushing to edit my video um, to go up tomorrow, which is Tuesday. And I got totally confused on the days because today was a holiday and everybody was home and I thought it was Sunday. I thought I had two more days. But I just have to say that burrito was so good. Probably the best burrito I've ever had. I ate the whole thing. <laughs> from the drive from Chipotle to the house, it was gone. I was so hungry. Um, I haven't had like a really yummy cooked meal, I think, since last Thursday, just because I was out of town all weekend. So I mostly ate just raw um, fruits. And I had a lar bar for dinner because I didn't want to go out. To, we didn't really go out to eat. So anyway, it was really good. I just wanted to tell you that if you haven't had one of those, you ought to. I'm going to watch The Bachelor live. I'm so excited. And if you guys are on Twitter um, or Facebook, actually, I'll probably Twitter The Bachelor. So hopefully you guys are on. It'll be too late by the time you're watching this, but next week we can live tweet during The Bachelor. It'll be so fun. All right. Got to go. Bye. I love Chloe's little world. She is so cute. Hi. What's going on in this room? What are all these animals doing? All seeing the Furby dance. Oh, it's like a recital? No, they're just watching the Furby dance. Oh. <laughs> so cute, Chloe. <laughs> Girls' night to the Fab Fit Fun. All right, what are you gonna what get? You, what are you gonna get? Okay, I'm gonna do, um, I'll do a burrito too because it's easier to eat in the car with a sofritas burrito. Brown rice, please. We just got. <laughs> I don't know what sweater to wear. One, we two, just three. got home. It's like what midnight? Past midnight. And Becky has a jacket, a bunch of sweaters. <laughs> I just had to put on video. Can I get my favorite? Oh my gosh, did fun. you have fun? I had a blast. Okay, so what did you think? Well, I brought you into the YouTube world tonight. Yeah. Well, I enjoy minute. meeting some of the girls. Yeah. It's different. And okay. people are just funny as they like stare at other people and And they're very observe. obvious with the up and down stare. Did you ever notice that? Like they don't uh, care that they look, just looked you yeah. from the shoes to the hair. And I think everyone's trying to figure out if they know who's, who's who. Yeah. I just got my eyes threaded and my makeup done, and that's what I. Um, but I just had a lot of fun with summer, and that's I know, what that was special. The best part. Thanks for coming. Thanks, I had a blast. Okay. I'll let you go off okay. camera now. I am back home inside and <laughs> cleaning up. This is this is my life. This is real life here. Kitchen's a bit of a mess because I left. We had a babysitter um, come and watch both of our kids, and then Jimmy. Um, I had to watch all of the kids until Matt got done with his seminary class. So um, I'm going to clean up. Oh, look. Chloe lost her tooth. I wonder if she cried every single tooth she's ever lost. She, like, literally screams and cries and is so freaked out by the blood. She can't even handle it. And earlier today, I was like, you should let daddy pull that out for you. And she was like, no, no, I don't. Please pray that it won't come out today. So that's cool. I'm glad that it came out and hopefully it was 
it wasn't so traumatic for her. Anyway, so I am going to clean out my smoothie cups that I brought with me in the car on the way up to the um, event. I pretty much stayed on track all day. I didn't have any of the, they didn't have a lot of food there, but they were like passing out little desserts and stuff. Um, it's so much easier now to just say no. Like before it would have been torture to turn down yummy desserts um, or even just yummy food or free food. Actually, I think it's about the free food. Now it's like I don't, I don't even have, I don't know, it's not that hard. Well, actually that's not true because around Christmas time it was really hard, but right now it's not. Um, so we stopped at Chipotle and we got a veggie burrito again. I love those. Like I literally want to eat one of those every night for dinner. It's so good. I have to get up so early to get the kids to school tomorrow. Um, it is my day, that my one day a week where both kids are in school. So I'm trying to decide. I do have an article for The Better Mom. If you guys don't follow that website, you guys should. They have a lot of just really, especially, I mean, it's for moms. If you're a mom, it's just a lot of really encouraging um, blog posts each day for moms. It's really good. So I have my post that goes up on Monday and I need to get that like finished up and it's done. I just need to edit it. So I probably will do that tomorrow. I need to film um, a new trailer for my, for my YouTube channel. So I thought about maybe doing that tomorrow if I feel like doing my makeup again. I don't know. I don't like to do makeup <laughs> on back to back days. Is that weird? Like if I wear makeup today, I feel like I shouldn't wear makeup again until Sunday. Like today's Wednesday. I actually like wearing makeup, but I don't like wearing it every day. So I want my skin to breathe. Speaking of makeup, it's not like the best lighting, but I thought I would just show you what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation, which I actually, I love it. Like I try other foundations. I just really like this one most. It is starting to break down a little bit, but I put it on. Mmm... Um, Maybe around 2 and it's almost 1 in the morning. Oh my word, it's almost 1 in the morning. But I did the Lorac Perfection Mattifying Primer today. I got a little sample and I think I really like it because I think it pretty much kept me matte. I did do the Scandinavia Bridal Makeup Finishing Spray, which I'm falling more and more in love with. I think I might need to use that every time I need my makeup to last. So I'm do I wore that and then um, for my contour, I, I used this, which Melissa got for me, Honey Bee Philosophy. This is the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Palette. Oh, I just love it. See that? So I'm wearing literally the blush and the bronzer, but I'm wearing the... Um, oh shoot, what is the... My favorite highlighter, the bomb, you know, the one from the bomb. Mary Luminizer, that's the one. And then on my eyes, I'm wearing my new Lorac um, unzipped palette, Smashbox liner, my Tarte mascara, um, and then the Bite Beauty lipstick in violet. And then I'm wearing my Irresistible Me hair extensions, my Twisted Silver, um, necklaces, and then I just have this like faux leather jacket here, a black dress, it's like, oh, I'm not very good with this with my camera, <laughs> and then my cowboy boots. It's like shorter in the front, longer in the back. It's like a mola dress, you know. It is one in the morning and I feel wide awake. I've not had caffeine, I've not had sugar, just my normal food, and I'm so wide awake because I need to wind down I have to get up at 7 in the morning tomorrow. I might actually go back to bed after I bring the kids to school. I have one more thing I wanted to say. I loved having Becky with me tonight at that YouTube event. I mean, it's, I don't know if it was a YouTube event. It was like the Fab Fit Fun event, but I think there was a majority of YouTubers there. I love doing these events. I think they're so fun, but sometimes they can just feel 
a little bit like lonely just because um, I have friends in the YouTube community, but um, I don't know, it's just hard. It's hard. So it was just so nice to have like my best friend with me and to just have it be like comfortable and authentic and just fun. And I don't know, it was just so, it was like the most fun I've had at any YouTube event I've ever been to. It was just, I loved having her there with me. So I told her, I'm like, from now on, you're with me at, you're coming with me to all of these events. Like you are just going, I'm just gonna have to give you the itinerary. I'm not even really asking you. I just loved having her there. She's just my like favorite. I love that girl. Look at this mess. I gotta go clean that up before you can go to sleep. Okay, I'm done, bye. It's Thursday afternoon and I just got this fun package in the mail and had to tell you guys about this because this was a brand that I found at IMATS called BTS Organics and I beelined for their booth because it was a natural skincare or makeup line and I wanted to learn more about it. So I spent some time talking, I think, to the owner and was just really impressed with her and really impressed with the makeup. So while I was there, I entered their raffle to win this and I won it. I'm so excited, I never win anything. So it looks like they sent me every single one, every single shade of their foundation. And then um, this is like their highlight concealer. Let's see if I can, yeah, it's like a highlighter on one side and a concealer on the other. This, if this concealer is too dark, you can use the highlight to kind of lighten it up a little bit. I played with this at their booth and was really impressed. And then this is like their setting powder um, that they have. And the cool thing about their makeup and their foundation is that it's skincare. Like it's anti-aging and treat. it's like treating your skin. It has so many benefits. It's like a skincare with makeup in it. So I tested it out on the back of my hand and really liked the finish of it. It's a light to medium um, coverage, but I think you, I'll play with it and see if you can build it up to um, maybe more full coverage. But maybe just for the days where you want foundation, you don't need a full face, I just think that this would be really cool. So I am excited to test it out. I'll leave the link below if you guys want to look at their website and read more about it. I was just really impressed and their packaging is just like feels really nice and um, yeah, I'm just excited. What you doing over there? Cleansing my guinea pig Callie. Is she eating something? Feeding me a carrot. What is that? I, I went ahead and at school and it's a hedgehog. Hold it still, let me see. It says Mr. Oh. Hedgehog. What happened to your hair? I just gave you a shower and now it's looking a little cray cray. Hold on. There we go. Ooh. That is cool, Taylor. It's a cool dragon. Jimmy's gone tonight. I'm super duper tired from last night. I didn't get to sleep till almost two. Had to wake up at seven. Um, did not get out of pajamas today, except to go pick up the kids. I put some appropriate pants on. Um, okay, hold on, Chloe. So, um, did that work out today? I know. I didn't even eat, like, fruit today. I did eat vegan, but I didn't eat fruit. I don't even, I don't even. It's just been a rough week. It's been a rough week. So, tomorrow is a new day. Um, okay, so we're going to have these chicken tenders for dinner. Not we, but the kids. And then I'm going to make some potato fries. Let's see. Um, not too bad of ingredients. This is my kind of cooking right here. Just throw it in the oven. Andrew jumped out. Bait. Put his hands back over his face. This time he put pulled them away when he was laughing. He said, but if I was a vampire, I wouldn't have to catch little boys. Just take my things into one of those bottles and have my supper. Besides, where have you ever heard of a vampire that knew how to drive a car? That made sense. And all the moving pictures shows that I'd seen in all the books. I'd read about vampires. I'd never could think of seeing one that could drive a car. But I wasn't going to take any chances. Could I please see your teeth, sir? What? Your teeth, sir? The man mumbled something, shook his head again, then leaned close to the window glass and opened his mouth. 
And then the sleeves. Oh my goodness, look at these sleeves. Do you see that detail of, oh my gosh, just so fun.